Here's Here we the go. Blessing. The it boogie is time man. for the I boogie man. Is he going to give Justin Rodriguez the nightmare? Let's hear from this is his pro debut. Oh yeah. Going for that Mr. Olympia ticket. All right, blessing Awadabu making his long awaited pro debut. And he has waited a few years for this moment to get on stage. He could have been on a pro stage some years ago, uh, but he opted to wait, try to put some muscle on, try to get his physique to a level uh, that would be an instant contender. Now, this is his bread and butter shot right here, this back double by. Oh, yeah. I'm getting a kick out of his posing trunks. Is that leopard? <laughs> yeah, like blue <laughs> leopard, I, I think. Or, I love it. Now, clearly, that was a, a, inspired by his buddy Kai Green, because they're on the same <laughs> team over there at Redcon 1. Yeah. Big shout out to Aaron Singerman out there. I know he's watching at home. Great job Looks he's like done with that company. his conditioning has actually sharpened up since this morning, too. Uh, he does look a little bit better. You know what? He, he probably won't, you know, this is the kind of guy, you, you, what you got to do is you got to junk him up after the prejudging. This is a guy go out and get some burgers and fries and come in full as a house. And it looks like he got some of that back. He came in a little bit flat this morning. Well, I Maybe. consider Blessing like a modern Kai Green. I think he has a very bright future. You know what? Uh, well, I, listen, he's got Kai Green in his corner. Again, that's his buddy. Yeah. Uh, they work together in the same company. If he's going to be taking advice from anybody, that's a real good guy yeah. to be taking advice from. Blessing is somebody that the sport needs. I mean, I love his energy. I love his trash talking. You know, we're going to see him again in New York Pro against, of course, Nick Walker. You've been seeing a lot of that going on. Uh, so he is someone that the sport definitely needs. Just great kid, good physique. Still got a lot of building to do, obviously. He's got an interesting scenario over the next six days as he is scheduled to be in New York. Now, he's got to fill it up while not giving away conditioning. Uh, that's not easy to do. Now, it can be done. It's just got to be done right. I and, love and, this and pose on Hopefully, he's got the right uh, team in place to kind of make that happen because you, you'd be surprised what you could do in six days. Now, keep in mind, he's also going to be doing the California at the end of the month. Well, he may want to rethink some of that this year, and only because, again, that's stuff that looks good on paper in the beginning of the year, and then you get two, three shows deep, and you go, man, what did I sign up for here? If I was blessing and running his camp, I think I would, obviously, he's here at the Indy. I think I would have him do New York, because it's next week. Uh, and then barring whatever happens there, I think I'm taking off the rest of the year in terms of I'm getting in, back into the gym. He's got a boat for the future. This guy's, this kid's got a bright future ahead of him. He's got Absolutely. a lot of years, hopefully, uh, that we'll see him on a competitive stage. But he needs a good, you know, 15 pounds of muscle on that frame to be a Kai Green. Right. And then you got a different ball game out there. I think we will be seeing him on the Olympia stage this year. This uh, year. This year. That would be something. Yeah. Bet right now, Bob. Twenty bucks. That's Plus, Twenty bucks.